Hey guys, welcome back to our video. This is episode four of the Zomboid series, and keeping the game paused so I can do my little intro. And uh, but yeah, this is episode four. I, I put three up with my fingers, but yeah, episode, episode four. I have actually have I, I have plans set for today, and uh, what you can zoom in on this. You can zoom it out in and out on the on the pause screen. I did not know that. Well, we're gonna get started here, and then. Um, I have a few set plans to do. Uh, we're gonna hit up the rest of the warehouse. I don't know, we did that yesterday. Or the, the, not yesterday, but the, did that in the last video. We're going to, um, first let me eat. I'll, let me eat first and then we'll uh, continue. All right, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna go hit up some houses in the neighborhood. And while I'm doing that, I'm gonna see if I can get a new car as well. Because I really need a new car. Because um, currently, let's let's just check the condition of this thing. I know this thing's pretty bad. Yeah, the tires are not looking good at all. Um, yeah, the front right tire is about and the rear right tire. So, but both the right tire is about to break. Um, is this a medium? What kind of tire is this? A standard car. That's a standard wheel. I think actually, I think I can actually change out the tires, which I'm going to do, because those um those tires aren't looking so hot, so we need to change those out ASAP. We may need a car jack. Oh, we I think we need a car jack, right? Oh no, yeah, that's another thing I need to find. I need to find a car jack. So um, we might have a little problem here. Let me let me uh. Yeah, we need a, j a jack. Okay, well, we don't have a car jack, so we can't do that. Um, well, well, let's just hope and pray that those um, that those tires don't break. So I guess maybe not trying to run over zombies while I am driving is a good idea. But this thing still absolutely just guzzles gas like nothing though. I, I, it's such a weird, it's so weird how that thing just goes through gas so easily. Okay, we're gonna go into town, um, into the deeper neighborhood here, and then we're gonna just, just loot the houses, get more supplies, or not, just do some supply runs, and um, hopefully, uh, while I'm doing that, get a new car. So, yeah, I'm trying to get there when I get there. All right, so we made it to the little little neighborhood here. Um, it's got a few houses. We're gonna go through all these houses in the block here and hopefully get a car. But if not, oh well. It's not the end of the world as long as we don't run over too many zombies. This this have a garage in it. We might be able to get a um, another no doesn't generator inside. We could get some more gas cans. That's what I like to see. Metal sheet. Metal sheets are useful. This backpack. I, I'm, I'm super happy I got the backpack and a crowbar in the same, or in the same video. So it's that's a um, big plus. Well, that's gonna be stale food. Or rotten actually. It's rotten. I'm having some rotten soup. Yum. Yummy. Oh, eat the. Yeah. Uh, get inside and clean myself. That was actually kind of scary. I really hope it's not affected. That's why we're going to uh, we're gonna go run upstairs instead. It's safer. All the windows are broken down there. So yeah, wash myself. Wash all clothing too. And then uh, just hope that it doesn't get infected. But maybe the more another backpack in here? No. Uh, another, another backpack couldn't hurt because it, it does. I think the backpacks can get damaged. No, they cannot. Okay, well it doesn't. Well, 
Whatever I was saying, just uh, ignore me. Ignore me then. But we could get some more frozen food. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna get a lot of frozen food by doing this. So, uh, that's a good thing. I'm in a lot of pain, so, um, it's gonna hurt my, uh, my damage, hurt my damage a lot. Is that a baseball player? It's a football player. They should make, like, if they have zombies like this, where it's, um, they've, like, they're, like, a special type of zombie, or this one's a football player, they should have it with more strength. That'd be kind of cool. More, like, randomly difficult zombies. That'd be kind of sick. That'd make it, uh, pretty interesting to see how you would, uh, fight those zombies. Like, you, they'd be running, too. Oh. That'd be, that'd be, um, very, 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 uh, scary. Cause you, know, you, could, you could have a whole team of football players just run up on you and just absolutely maul you alive. But I need to wash again because I, I just want to keep clean as much as much as possible. So if I get infected, it's all over. And using disinfectant doesn't really def doesn't really help against it. It's just I think cl killing your bo cleaning your body is what helps. Not just slapping some disinfectant on there. I don't know if it's I don't know if it's me or something, but my um, computer feels like it's running faster. Either that, or they uh, or they did like the loading stuff. I can actually like I'm loading all the terrain easily. I don't know what it is. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm just going insane. That could be it too. I think I should I should rip the up rip up these this, uh these clothing though because I, I could use them in the future. So and I could use them right now since I'm currently bleeding in my bandage. There also might be a hole where the uh, I got the laceration. So there might be less there's gonna be less defense there for sure. But um I, I, if I just don't get hit I'm good. So, we'll just, uh, let's just try not to get hit anymore. I think that's a good idea. Because I literally could have died there. L literally. Oh, uh-oh. Well, let's just leave the house quick. Uh, pineapple, yeah. You know. Nothing in the freezer. I can't believe this is the house to give me a um, house alarm. I did not want to do that. Oops. I could use this to upgrade my blunt, though. But actually, there might be a lot of zombies coming. Yeah, actually. Uh, yeah, there's a lot of zombies. Let's run to the car. Get to the car. Let's go. We gotta move. We're going to the library right now. Instead, of, that's just, there's gonna be a lot of zombies there, so we'll just come back to that later. We'll stay off the main street. Actually, let's go to the main street. It's gonna be easier to navigate.
I'm out. There's too many zombies for some reason. They all just... They're all coming out of the woodworks, man. For no reason. There's too many. Just keep coming and coming, dude. Nothing I can really do. Oh, that's another... Okay, this, this engine is not looking too good. I know it already. Dude, the brakes in this thing are getting worse. This thing can't even reverse. It can't even reverse. <laughs> what the heck? Okay, well, the car can't reverse no more. Let's uh, let's take, let's take a look at the engine. I don't know what's wrong with it. Actually, maybe maybe there's something with my with my keyboard. Oh no, it could reverse. Okay, I don't know what was wrong with me. It was something with my keyboard somehow. Never, never mind. There's no problem with the car reversing. And uh, I'm very, very sad to say that. My man, Hector Nelson, is not going to make it through this apocalypse any longer. He's only got a few days left. He's queasy, and he's a nervous wreck right now. He woke up absolutely mortified and sick. And that, if you know what that means, he's infected with the zombie virus. Oh, no. I can't. I didn't think it happened this soon. I didn't actually think it was happening this soon. Our man Hector Nelson is gonna die. Well, there is two things I could do. One is the normal. I just end it like I, I die and I end it surviving for seven days. Or I could get three leather strips before I, I turn and make a skill journal and write down all of my skills I have collected so far, which is not much, but it's it's saving a little bit of grinding. And write down all the skills in that skill book journal. And then save it for my next character to take and reuse. And basically, I, basically like I never even died. <sighs> Both a new character and a new little story. That's what I could do. But I'm not going to do that yet. I'm just going to... Leave it up to you guys. See if what you guys want me to do. But I will get the leather strips, so we just have so we have the option. So I'm gonna just save you the time. There's probably some dead bodies around on the street somewhere that has a leather jacket on. So I'm just gonna save you that time. I'm gonna cut that out and just go find it. But that's where we'll leave it off today. I, I've only been recording for 35 minutes, just halfway through the recording. I usually do. So it isn't really it doesn't really last that long. So I'm gonna end it here, I guess, and then we'll continue in the next one. And I will be probably a new person. A new character. It's just that I'll have left my mark with Hector Nelson in this house. Poor Hector, man. He I didn't think he would lose it. I didn't think I would uh he would die this fast. I'm surprised that last person actually killed I'll, I try to be clean as possible too, man. It's not, it's not our day. It's not our day, apparently. But, uh, well, I hope you guys enjoyed uh, Hector Nelson's little story. We'll continue off on someone new. I don't know who it would be. It could be Felipe. It could be um, Victor. It could be Craig. I don't know. Someone, someone random. But, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. It's, this short, this is going to be really short. It's going to be like, 15 10 minutes man it's insane but uh yeah hope you guys enjoyed uh like subscribe and uh peace expect a video soon